Yeah, Is there anything else you want to teach? Because <laughs> I'd be really interested in just being taught loads of stuff for free. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Right. So basically, the problem with working in resin is it takes two to three days for it to set. All right. So what we work on today, we can't finish until next week, because what we'll do is we'll stick it all on a table and shove it against that wall, and we'll leave it there till next week and then it will all be set and then we can, we can play with it next week. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna pour stuff today, so create stuff today, and then next week we'll do another little session and what it is, is about how you polish it and shine it and make it all look pretty, all right? So I've got this, this is one of the things you do with resin is you make cakes, all right? So this is, this is a bit of a cake that I made, so what happens is you make a little mold up and then you pour it in layers is it wood so, on the bottom? It's a piece of wood on the bottom. Yeah, yeah. Do you have right. to wait for the first layer to dry? And yes. Then... Okay. You, can, you can put the next... <laughs> the problem with this is, this is liquidy like honey. And if you put it in while it's still oh, yeah. wet, what will happen is they, they blend together. Yeah. Is it hot and does it burn? No. It gets warm, it? it? gets warm and you can't pour more than two and a half centimetres at a time because oh, yeah. it will get hot yeah. and there's some problems with it. And if you it's get it on your clothes, does it stay there? Oh yes, forever. Right, okay. All right. Never so ever. what happens is, uh, one of the things you can do when you make bits of jewellery is you make up these sort of like cakes yeah. Yeah. and then you slice them. Oh yeah. All right, and then what you do is you start take off a slice and you polish it. All right, so that is no. a piece from that. Oh, that's great! Really? Yeah, that's really great. Right. But this oh, that's a treat. is when you make it really thin, you can do stuff like this. So you pass, can I yeah, that one? right, that's impressive. I like that. Yeah, yeah. Yes. so you could you can cut these down further and, and then start yeah. polishing, yeah, really. and you can go for different. Wow. Mm. All right. So the, what we're going to do next week, as well as the bits we're going to pour now, I will cut some blanks from that. So I've, got, I've got a couple of, a couple of like normal oh, paint yeah. or glue, where it's still if wet. you just That's leave like it long enough, it will go off. That's like the sticky that you've got on your bedroom wall. Oh yeah. no, it's sticky still. Is it a case it's of a tiny wet. bit of hard note to a lot of resin? It's it's either. Th um, uh, hundreds to you fifty. You can dab your fingers right. if you're you right. Yeah, I've heard your reaction. 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 Yeah, they're quite lumpy on the top, aren't they, with something in it, like glue so, or So that's, that's the mould, yeah, I have a look, that's the mould, and then that's that's one that came out of that mould. These are all different ring shapes and sizes. So if you look at the mould, it Do starts with... Do you have to with, know your ring size? Or no, because that's you completely you set. Oh, yeah, yeah. Right, so this this is, that's a commercial, commercial resin, right? <laughs> so, and actually, the, so what happens is you would pour, pour that whole that whole mould and you would get a ring from size A to size Z out of the one mould. You'd have to polish You know those cake tins, the yeah. silicone ones, could you do it out of those as yeah. well? You can, so for instance we've got these sorts of moulds, yeah, yeah? Um, and, and you basically you make up what you want to put in them. So you can put like bits of flowers in them, you can Ooh. put coins yes. in them, you can, and I actually, I, for, for yeah. you lot to play with, I have got little, because there's lots of colours and we'll, we'll do colours in a bit, yeah. right? So basically what happens is you mix it up as, as, a, as it looks like water, right? And then you then put in any colours or whatever, right? The one problem when you put this sort of stuff in is if you're not careful, it floats to the surface. Oh yeah. Right, so you have to sort of heavy stuff is easy because it doesn't float, right? And what you would normally do, we can't, we haven't got time to do it today. But what you would normally do if you're doing this is you would put a really thin layer in, and and the glue, the, the resin is you can play with for about an hour. So at about fifty minutes, when it's almost gone off, it becomes really sticky. You then knob a flower in, and then pour the next ah, layer on yeah, top. So so it, so it would hold it down. Mm. Yeah. What we're gonna have to do is just have a go and see if it stays at the bottom. Yeah. I've got some shells as well. They're, they're quite big and some of them are... They're awesome. Yeah, we're just... 
But we've got, I've also got like, like this flake of other. So what we're going to do is have a play. Brilliant. Right? So they're what? Passing them on. I don't get it. What's going on there? What, 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 so no, so because the mould is bigger. It. So what, what you're, you're pour going to do is there. There. you pour it in here, right? And where there's a gap, is where the resin goes in. Yeah, right. Right. So it, it's not this shape. No. Right. It, it's that shape. Right. And then these, you get that middle piece, and they fit inside that mould. So you actually, what you end up with is an You've upside down. So you turn it up that way. Yeah. And it so you end up flat. flat. And then, and then, then they all slide into it. I see. Right. Right. Oh, holder. Right. A holder. Yeah. Holder. Right. With right. Your, yeah. Yeah. So why is pain about you? I see. So there's like little pinky ones which are. Uh, for earrings or little pieces. This, yeah, this is stuff for right. making <laughs> pieces to add to jewelry. Yeah. And they had really cool ones, like they put little bits of glitter in and have ones in. Mm -hmm. I've this got earrings that I can bring next week yeah. if people want to make earrings. Yeah. Alright, here's a question then. What's, what's that one? Who the dick is that? Okay. Go on then. This is the, pass it round and see if anyone can. There is another version of it. Shop cut tray. Which is that one? So this is, if you want to go that way, have a look at that. But those two bits go together, and that's that another version of that one. Is it right. for a lid? Uh, not quite. Pass it around and see what anyone else can do. You've got to guess what that yeah. is. It's this what? bit slots into here. Oh, it's phone stand. Home stand yeah. yeah, it's for your mobile phone. Uh, I've seen you've made one of those at home. I yeah. like that. But this is just a pattern, just a decorative. Yeah, 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 right, yeah. yeah. so yeah. that slot fits into that slot and it gives you an upright yes. with a little peg on the back. To stand it. Stand. Ah, and what's I there see. is in two sections. So the big one is the back plate and then the little one slots in from the back. So what, what you yeah. end up with is, is that oh, sort of like shape. That. Yeah. 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 And you put your mobile phone on it. So it kind of stands like yeah. that? Yes. Yeah. I've got one of these in my workshop. I use to put my phone on Yeah. Right, so you can you can have the two little pieces, and then when they they actually, so you can make well, different colours and all that sort of stuff. And what you end up with is is an interlocking heart. Interlo inter yes, to share. Yeah. yeah. What's this in, Scott? Because that looks fine. Really oh, this, that, that's, 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 that's a bit. Just I I just cut that at home. Oh, it's good. Right? Just right. pulled the resin. Yeah. Pulled the resin. So all I did this way. If you turn it over. Yeah. All I did was I put sellotape across the backs of this right. to stop it like dripping all over the table. Mm. It doesn't like sellotape. No, no. It, it does. It gets as long as you keep to less than two and a half centimeters in depth each time you pour. Mm. It doesn't get that hot. It gets warm like a, an off cup of coffee, not like oh my god, I'm going to melt the table. Yeah, yeah. Um, but I. But what's nice about it? You hold it it's up to the light. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. I like that a lot. That's really good. Yeah. Okay. All right. Oh, make a nice bowl, oh, wouldn't you? A little bit bigger. No, there's two. I think they mm. interlock. I like this one. Well, they lock and they lock together. Charred wood look very nice. So two of them, when they're poured, yeah, one slots into the other one. Okay. All right. So what I'd like to help with today is to pick at least one. Oh, that's a. What's that one? That's a soap dish. Well yeah, done, yeah. John. Yeah. <laughs> I thought they looked really pretty. Now, yeah. People would put like flower petals and they've done like two different colours and it just looks really pretty and I thought, you know what, we'll add that one to the... I got one like that. Oh my god. Mm. That'd be good actually. Yeah, totally. yeah. right. So, what I'd like people to do is either pick one big one or two or three little ones. Oh, that's yeah, for making a bowl. Yeah. Right. I've never used it, so really and what you do is you put it all together, yeah. 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 pour the resin in, in, and then the hope is the it will when you it crack will, it. Yeah, they're really good. Yeah. Talking to mum, literally. Yeah. Like that. Cool. Oh, and I've got little little like teddy bears, little teddy bears and shit. So yeah, <laughs> basically, I got bored on eBay <laughs> and, 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 and I bought twenty quid's worth of moulds yeah. of random <laughs> things that <laughs> just just amused me. Oh, right? yeah. So. What I'd like people to do is either pick a big mould or pick two or three little moulds and then what we'll do is we'll go through the process of actually pouring them and making them and colouring them and all that sort of stuff. From a colouring point of view, we have got lots of colours, right? There are, I, and I, have, I also have the sparkly algae oh, everywhere because it's got all the sparkly shit in it, right? Um, I've also got... I don't know how good it is. This is glow in the dark. Oh, what? Right. So what you do is you put a little bit of this in, and the theory is if you put it out in the sunlight and then you take it in a dark place, it will do the glowy glowy bit. Yeah. Right. Do right. Like so we can do sticks. glowy glowy. Right. In the nighttime, they glow. Also got my 
sort of just sparkly. Basically, it's colouring in shit, yeah. right? and there's loads of it, right? So, pick a mould, pick cool, what you fancy, blue. and then we'll get on them. And we'll, 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 you, we won't get punching because we're not doing anything sharp, but what you'll get is no, nails. Oh, nails. Oh, nails. Nails like daggers. Yeah. <laughs> They're kind of a small, one. but with an extra on the end of the fingers. Yeah, that's for fingernails, that one. Well, I repaired boats. Oh, I think it's for earrings, I think that. Yeah, fed up with that, uh, yeah. The dangly yeah. earrings. Yeah. 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 It was good for about that's an hour and a half. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Can I teach you with some gloves? What's that, the cream yeah, stuff? The, the cream stuff isn't as good as the gloves, but it's, it's, all, it's to save so your that. hands. So. Yeah, can I do that? <laughs> so you know, it, I'm cream. It's it's so like that. okay. Yeah. The is pretty good stuff, isn't it? It's pretty really good stuff. It's made, this world without plastics, so yeah, I don't think yeah. it will, it yeah. looks. I thought it was going to be like a polyester it. resin. That's what they use a lot of the time, isn't it? So this is proper epoxy. So what I'm doing is I'm doing 100 grams of the resin and then 45 grams of the hardener. What the hell is going to happen? Right. So can you pass that down the table without putting it? What is it? It's it's basically plastic. It's liquid plastic. Don't put it in there. That's what we're going to do. Yeah. And then whatever's left over, we'll yeah, fill other molds with. And then how long do we leave it? Yeah. We're going to have to leave it for uh, two to three days. Gold. So yeah. next week, they should be and hard and we'll take them out. I'll leave them in the moulds like until next week. Delicious. And then we'll peel them out and see yeah. what we get. Yeah. When, when do you have your goldy bits? Or, uh, yeah. Now, today. Now, right. Yeah. Well, as we mix now. Yeah. So what yeah. I yeah. recommend is uh, uh, taking you wood stick. Right, because you want to start, start fresh, right? Mm -hmm. And basically pour into this a little amount of resin and have a play at putting the colour into it, right? You need about a, a tenth of the colour you think you need. Okay. Right, you go, oh, I need a, you know, no, no. It's like, put, it's like putting spice in your dinner, mm -hmm. right? You go, oh, I'll have a shovel full of that. And it's like, oh, that was, yeah, you want a Smaller tiny than make your way amount. Up. Are so you literally colors, are, are so, these drops? So if, if you, there are lots of different types, so yeah. there's, there's a whole trays of stuff. Right. right. Um, if you I want to see the light them through them, you have to make it very thin yes. with the colour. Right, yeah. If you want a solid, I can't see through it, then it's like four drops instead of one drop. Yeah. Right? But what I would recommend, like eye drops, I would put one little drop in, give it a stare for a few minutes, yeah. and see if you like it. So you're going to make some coloured in the small one, and then yeah. add and the then, small one to that bit by yes. bit to get the colour you want so in mix, there. Mix up in here, like, yeah, yeah. like a mixing bowl. Yeah. If you like the, the recipe, Oh, and you want to do it for the whole thing, right. you then know, oh, well, actually, we do that for the whole cup. Right. Or if you want to do it in different colours, you can do different colours. So yeah. How much do you put in? That's the million dollar question, and that's why you're going to do it in a little cup and test. Okay. And when you either then pour the little cups in, or, yeah, we, you make up a bigger version of it. So this, so is, this is the experiment. This is fart about and, and find colours that you like. Where are all the sticks? The sticks yeah. are in the middle of the table. All oh, right, okay. Yeah. So, so if I'm doing multiple colours, I can just pour them in and it kind of makes a marbly, smoky Yeah, so from, from your point of view, I would I would use them. Half fill them, because that's about the right amount for one of those coasters. Okay. Right? Play with this until you get the colour that you like. Mm -hmm. Yeah? And then when you're ready with them, we'll sit them for a few minutes, just let the bubbles <coughs> come out, and then we'll pour, just pour different ones. What if you want some sparklies in with the colour? So you put them in Play. as well now? Yeah, yeah. play with yeah. it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Right. Kind of thing, I want a bit of black with a bit of clear and a bit of sparkly gold. Make many cold cups and try pouring. Oh my word. And how do you work with gold? <laughs> it's so exciting. It is, it's getting together, isn't it? Get a little bit out. Um, I would put the gold so leaf in the first there, yeah. and then pour resin on top of it. Will that not make a, oh. will that not make the surface funny? The resin stick, on no, because what will happen is the <laughs> gold leaf will move. Like little pots. Yeah, but because yours, when yours are finished, they're going to be the other way up. Yeah. So the worst that's going to happen is it's going to be sitting on the floor bit. Yeah. But you'll have smooth resin on the top. Cool. Yeah. Can I okay. that? Oh, oh you yeah, perfect. But this is the this is the art this is the, okay. the art crafty bit. This is the um, yeah. sort of mix stuff. The other bit to say, I've got. Uh, oh, I'm scared. Oh, I'm gonna have to do that. Risky. 
That's my ice. What are these? Do you put the things in later or first? So it depends how you want it to look, but I've been putting the bits in. What about and then another, another colour, like purple? Oh. Well, it's like going to be good. <laughs> <laughs> I'm having paint mixed up, isn't it? Let's get excited. Yeah. <laughs> What's going to happen? Can we make a unique custom colour? It is, isn't it? And then you go and go, oh, I've rolled three gallons of that, and then sweet, yeah, right away. <laughs> so then we could put this back in there to see if it's dark enough so, or whatever. If you like, if you, do you want the whole thing that colour? Probably, yeah. Right, in which case, you know roughly how many drops you've put, put in, in there. there yeah, okay. You now try to replicate it. And yeah, that's cool. Now, I thought, would have thought you'd have been a bit glassed and like, like lots of colours. No, I want a sort of blue one, but we've got some We're gold not sparkly like that, that in here. So personally, I would, I would place the, the sparkly bits Some in, of us are really straight. and then gently pour the resin on top. Really? Not have it in the resin? <laughs> yeah, it, it'll, it'll go under the sparkly bits. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah, it will go around them. And the other option would be to use two slightly different oh colours, I suppose, God. and have it swirl. That might look nice. Spilling. Because what you could do is put it in two cups. Yeah. Pour one from either end. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Can we put it in the cup now? Yeah, now, now it's about... So, mold. do you, if you want there, put it in the mould. <sighs> wow. So do we know how, how much that holds compared to that? Like, is that, yeah, that like five times that? That's that much and that's that much. Which makes it hard to know how many drops do you have. Well, how many did you get for that? How many drops did you put in there? Three. So that's probably going to be sort of six or eight. Yeah, okay. So I would put three or four in. Yeah, yeah, I recommend that. Do you want to do that one yellow? Yeah. Yes. And a bit more. Yeah. Do you want a yellow? Yeah. yeah. I want to do that beside yellow. There's some fine. yellow. So in which case, have... Or do you want sparkly off. yellow? Got, have got, have another little cup. Mix up some more in there. Yeah, I'm really going to town on this. It makes me so happy. Do you know what? <laughs> Who's like... Six to eight. Yeah. I oh might be God. ten at a push. Can I have some glow in the dark powder? Yes. What you mustn't do with the glow with, with absolute powders, and that's a, yeah. a real powder, the powder must never be more than five percent of the resin. Okay. I so was you can't put teeny if you, tiny because what happens is it then stops the resin there's not enough yeah. resin to glue it together. With, with the powders. <coughs> I hope you know that I've stopped taking any photographs now. I had noticed. Yeah, mind your elbows, because if you were. I'm seeing this white. Right, well, put that there. Oh, that looks pretty damn cool. Come out of the way. They get very angry. Yeah, it's nice going to be there. Yeah, that's my bet. Well, it's not enough down the side, I think, you know. Right, yeah. So I want a little bit of that one in the yeah. top there. Your hand's shaking. Oh, it does shake. Right, you're going to do that. What's that one for? Oh, that's all. Any spare, any leftovers. Uh -oh. So I'll leave the clocks. I'll put them. In, I'll put the, the tissue in the bin. Oh. But any any spare resin, we'll put in there, and we'll make up more blocks. Oh. I definitely need more of that. Right. Crucial, bro. I think I'm with me gold leaf. Oh. I like it, it's glittery. Wow! Oh. That looks that wonderful. So much of that, we might need to mix up a bit more for you. Really? No, that Wait, needs to... Yeah, it's got to hit the top of the mould. Is it? No. Well, no. Like, this is self-levelling, so it should just... I'll be, I'll be deep enough. Right. So scrape so out from where you yeah. Yeah. the stick. Pour some in. And then whatever colours you want. So I'm making up little ones. Yeah. I've got my big one yeah, there, which is the glow yeah, in the dark. Is there something on the door? Thank you. Oh, somewhere yeah. there. Just... Hang on, see, sir, it's all good. Oh, oh turn to go away, we're having too much fun. Because <laughs> <laughs> you've got a lot of resin left over, yeah. would you like to put some in it? Stick. Right, let's do that one. All right, we'll give it a go then. I think it was that one. Wait, I don't need yellow. Need to there is a yellow. Uh, that's, that looks a better one. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to no, go with that. Oh, well, this is the one with oil in. Right. Shall I drop so, in a major glove? That's the question. So, pick a colour. Mix. Yeah. Yes, yeah, you then could. And then pour it into something. You should love yourself. Kind of, yeah. So and then, 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 then
You could put it on the, the top so you can sort of see it. Yes, yes. Otherwise, it, will it sink? It will oh, definitely that's sink. Cool. Yeah, that's cool. It's that colour, yeah. So shuffle it around so it fills in. Yeah. We did plastic at this school. Plastic. You never had this at school. What did you do at school? Plastic. Mm -hmm. What, what like this? One lesson. One, yeah. And a bit of Oh, careful that's work. not dripping on your clothes there. Oh, you're lucky to be oh, able to do that. Oh, you've got a little bit there. Oh, yeah, work. Yeah, I love that. Because when this goes on, it will close the vibe before it does. Yeah, have that bit if you don't will it burn? It. it won't burn, it will just stick like glue. Yeah. Oh, Scott, they're in the pot. Pot, pot, pot. Where's the pot gone? Where's the pot gone? Where's the pot gone? Ah, the pot's up there, Scott. It's got the forms in. <laughs> oh, hello. <laughs> you want to come and join us? 